What's up guys, Marcus Davis with Weasel News. And we're here for another installation of the Los Santos Talent of the Week. We got here John Robert, who actually lost his job and is now forced to panhandle here on the pier. Let's hear his story and what he's got. I came in the house, that's when I saw my mama crying. Said I asked what's wrong. My mama told me she had that cancer, cancer. And mama might die soon. My mama told me she might die soon. Mama told me she might die soon. That's when I was 16, sitting in that cell. That's when the officer came up to me. I thought I'm gonna get bill, but then I feel that something went wrong. Like I'm kinda feel my mama was gone. My nigga, if you feel me, if you feel a melody, na 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 That's when the bullet just crossed my head, and I was laying down thinking I was dead. Wow, that was beautiful, John. Thank Truly you. beautiful. Thank you, mate. That's a true story, bro. True story. There we go. And action. Alright. It's Marcus Davis here. It's June 6th. We're down by the pier. We just got word of a string of food poisonings from this very place, the bean machine. It appears as though their beans were, are, I don't know, they put rocks in their beans or something. Everyone's been getting sick here. We got a few angry customers. I'm going to ask them about it. Sir, <coughs> did you eat here? You see, I'm not, bro, but that's, they got some food I'm eating here, but it's so shit of food, bro, bro. I got no choice. <coughs> oh, man. What happened? You've been throwing up? <coughs> Uh, what? You've all been throwing up from it? Yeah, uh, yeah bro. Ah, uh, some shit, bro. Let's match this. Yo, I chill. My first and I... last time coming here, I'm telling you that now. Yeah, my first and True. my last time, bro. True. Alright, boys. Well, you heard it here first. I'm Marcus Davis. Now I come to the bean machine. Thank you. Yeah. What's going on guys? It's Marcus Davis here with Weasel News. We're here at the Catholic Church in downtown. Uh, I'm here with the pastor, Father Phil McGee Jr. And he's got an advertisement he's uh, looking to put up. So, Father Phil, would you, if you would please? Yes, certainly Marcus. Thank you very much. Now, citizens of Los Santos, let me introduce you to the Soul Saver Catholic Starter Package which we are offering here at this church for $299. What I can offer you today is a baptismal, okay? Not only that, you get rosary beads, a small Bible for your pocket, and a big Bible for your bedside locker. So for 299, come on down, get baptized, save your soul, don't go to hell. Catholic Church, Father Phil. Now, Mr. Davis. As I descend your head into the water, I wash away your sins and the souls. All those wooden oh. stands. Stop oh. wriggling, sir. Jesus is entering you. Stop wriggling. Oh. As, I, as I enter you as Jesus' patron, I wash away your sins. All for the bargain oh. price of 299 with a pair of rosary beads, small Bible, big Bible, and a good old blessing. Stop wriggling. Ascend. Ascend. A Christian man. Stand up. <laughs> yes. Did you feel the Lord? Did you feel him? Why are you crying? Are yeah, you emotional? And that's that's the package you can get. Come on down, Father Phil two nine nine. Save your soul. Bargain. What's up guys, Marcus Davis here. We're at the pier with the uh, father, Phil McGee Jr. He actually, uh, in his spare time when he's not teaching the word of God, he comes down to the pier with his mobile soup kitchen and gives food to the homeless. So, uh, we actually, it looks like a homeless man's walking up now. John. Hey John. Come, come hither child, come hither, come hither, you look. Sure, you're wearing away. You're wearing away. What can what can I get you? Um, um, one taco, please. Uh, with the kitchen, just one. 
vegetables, just ketchup, rot sauce. You get me, well, yeah? Well, we specialize in phallic food here at uh, Father Phil's uh, soup kitchen. So how about a hot dog with a cupcake stuck on the end? Hot dog? Yeah, with a cupcake stuck on the end. They, they love them, the homeless people. Hey, bro. Hot dogs, yeah? Yeah, just get it and just shove it in your mouth and the God, that, that, that's spreading God's word. Nah, nigga, f*** it. F*** the hot dogs. I don't want the rocks, bro. Well, you're, you're a heathen, sir. You're a heathen. Cursing, swearing, you're probably not even Catholic, are you? Anyway, I'll f*** your wife anyway, sir. Get I don't, I don't even have a wife. I can't have a wife, you <laughs> Huh? I can't have a wife, my f***ing priest, you fool. I mean your mum then, bro. Uh, God, your wife. God, you.